Hello everybody, welcome to the last video of this course creating a custom search engine in PHP. Friends, I will uh, again come to that uh, presentation which we discussed last time. We say, uh, I t told you in the first video, introduction video of this course that what you are going to learn. Creating a custom search engine in PHP in MySQL from scratch. You have just learned that we started working from absolutely blank page and wrote all the codes, typed all the code by ourselves. Fetching data from the MySQL database, we have also learned that. Inserting site details into database and displaying back to the users, we have learned that. Creating search result driven dynamic pages. So we have also done that because whenever someone uh, writes a query inside the search box, so a dynamic page is created automatically and is driving the results from the database uploading and displaying images in the search result we have done that also and we have uploaded images as well as displayed on the page uh, and uh, the course components were insert page we have created that and successfully run that on the browser search.html we created that as well result.php we created that as well uh, database we have created a database for this project in a table inside that called sites and also a search engine folder which you will find in my course and uh, also an images folder so now how to use database the data we have inserted in uh, inside a database called search when we click that database you can find that in localhost so there is a table called sites inside the search database so this sites table is having some uh, results sorry some records or some uh, rows we have inserted in using or insert underscore site.php page so if you want to import this sites table then you can easily import it export it sorry first you will have to export it and save it on your local computer and after that you can use it uh, you can import in another database so after you download this file you will have to export it to your uh, database if you have created a database so I am just exporting it from here there is an option you can export this whole database the tables inside the database basically so I will click the export button and it is asking that the format what should be the format I said yes SQL is okay you don't need to change any option from here and just go click go and it will ask where to save this database SQL file this is basically SQL file dot with that SQL extension so I will go to the same folder inside Zame. there is a folder root sorry htdocs is a root folder and a search engine is there a search engine folder so I will just save it there it is just saved now in the next part when you will create a database with the name search inside your own local host you will just use this import option click you will click the import option import option and from here you will choose file you will just add that file mm. that file is here issue docs search engine this is the file search.sql open it and after that click go so this will be inserted imported uh, into your own database and you will be having the same table I created for this project in the same data that it has and I will also give you the complete uh, folder of this search engine uh, with the images that we inserted so you can use it for your own practice or for your own uh, search engine so this is your search engine very basic very awesome very simple search engine you can make it more beautiful by modifying its CSS now I hope you have liked this course and after this course if you have learned something and you like this course then kindly leave a review uh, for this course and also recommend this course to others and also check out my other upcoming courses of complete e-commerce websites social networking websites in other big projects mega projects in PHP so see you soon thank you very much for uh, watching my course and for taking my course and I'm very sorry for my weak English which I you know I will try to improve
थैंक यू बाय बाय